don't want to laugh and i've worn a business suit for this video because i need business don't look at me don't don't look at me because you're you're part of the problem so i've worn a business suit for this video because i need business okay i'm not happy it's a rant it's a rant for me and for all my short girls i'm i'm coming like i'm doing it for all of us okay i'm selling them for all of us so this video i'm going to title it short girl code because i want to tell you the do's and don'ts mostly don'ts that you need to should i say observe around your short friends or adhere to around your short friends around your short family members around your short spouses around your short work colleagues around around short people in general short girls because look short men can do theirs short men can tell us what their problems is i i honestly don't know what <laughs> i don't even like short men and i'm short I didn't want to laugh in this video. <laughs> I wanted to do this video. I wanted to take it very, very seriously, but <laughs> you can't. Okay, I think I'm part of the problem as well. But oh, my name is Francesca, by the way. If you're new and if you've just bumped into me for the first time, that means you're new. So um, consider being a friend by subscribing. So let's start. Let's start this video. Short girl problems. Oh no, not short girl problems. So before this video, you're going to see the other video. It's called Short Girl Problems, which you know are the problems that we have, that I have, and I believe every other short girl has in life. Now, if you've watched that video, if you haven't watched that video, please go back and watch it because that video is going to tell you the problem and then this video is now going to tell you what to do and what not to do. So that you're not contributing to the problem or so that you're not aggravating the problem and without talking too much or without talking more than i already have i'm going to dive into this video number one problem is don't always remind me that i'm short i mean i know what my height is don't don't always remind me you're so small you're so short I know I think by this time I know already after living for up to 15 years and then like 15 I think 15 years is the time okay let's just say 18 years is the time that you know that okay I'm actually not going anywhere else from here like this is it for me so stop stop telling me stop reminding me okay I already know stop looking at my shoes and my clothes and asking me how do you fit into that leave me alone <laughs> like leave me leave us alone so those are don'ts oh do although not in every aspect okay do tell us that we look young like it's an achievement because we are small everybody thinks that we are young you know but it's it can be annoying to always think it can be annoying for me when the shops always want to see my id card before they can sell me alcohol i mean i am a grown woman do you know how old i am 57 years old so you know don't always ask us in annoying situations where our id card is or if you can hear any noise there is a cooking going on in the background and then yeah so stop calling us Stop reminding us that we are small and in light of that can you please not always say you're cute there are other descriptions to use when you say cute once it's okay it's like nice i see i see what you're saying i see i see it you say don't look at me this video is really for you you say cute twice i i kind of see what you're saying thrice it's like <laughs> By the time you keep saying it, especially when you say it when we're angry, like I'm not, I'm not cute. I am angry. I'm mad at you. Like I'm not, I'm angry. Okay. And 
and I said I was part, maybe part of the problem because I was going to say with my size nobody takes me seriously and because I said it in the short girl problem that because I'm small nobody takes people seriously when they're short like if we're angry let us be angry don't think that it's cute for us to be venting and angry or <laughs> stop it it's a rant video okay so you know excuse me for rant also stop saying things like we are adorable when we ask for help that's also in thing in among or uh, in in line with saying that we are cute all the time like the step ladder in this house i bought it out of frustration and annoyance at who mister over there i bought it out of because every time i i needed to reach some when i'm angry what happens i can't talk Every time I needed to reach something that I can't reach, I'll always climb if he's not around or I'll ask him to come get it for me. And then I ask him, once I just say, come get this thing for me, he's like, <laughs> why are you laughing? What's funny? What's funny? Why are you, why are you laughing? Just stand up and come and get the thing for me. You, you must laugh first. I don't get it. And in line with this, it's also it also happens like in the shops i go to the shops and i can't reach some shelves and you know people when i ask people to get it for me they're like smile don't smile look up just get it for me so it's I'm, like, <laughs> you, I'm embarrassed that i can't get the thing by myself okay if you have short friends or short colleagues family members spouses when you're walking be considerate please be considerate don't be walking as if you're running to heaven our legs are short our legs my legs are like this okay so if your strides are like that 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 my strides are like don't, why where are you running to like i have to keep up with you i have to take extra steps to keep up with you so i'm already panting and you think why is she panting already so, you know, be considerate when you're walking, okay? I'm very, very mad. <laughs> I'm very mad. I'm very angry at the way you people treat short people. It's not fair. It's not nice at all. Stop it. Change. Change for the better. Be better. Do better. And short people, if you're short, take this video and share it around your friends and your family. I'm telling them what you can't tell them or what you think is too rude to tell them. I'm telling them what you've told them very nicely. I'm telling them so that they know how very angry we are, okay? Don't think it's okay for to tell us that you want to carry us every time. Sometimes, I, I don't know, you're human. You always want to be carried. Sometimes we don't want to be carried. I mean, because I'm the size that I am, I can be carried a lot by my husband. <laughs> and I request for it too. I once asked my husband to give me a pig, not once, more than once. My husband has given me piggybacks more than once on the streets of this city. <laughs> you remember? We want to be carried sometimes, you know, because I'm a princess. You have to carry me sometimes. But yeah, I'm a princess and my legs can't touch the ground. You have to carry me sometimes. But, you know, don't always think that. It's okay to lift us up. Like, what is more annoying? Do you know I've been in the shops one time and I couldn't reach a shelf and I asked someone to help me get something from the shelf and he asked me, do you want me to lift you up? And it was supposed to be funny. He thought it was funny. I forgot to laugh. This one is very annoying. Why? You do it a lot. You're very, very, very culpable of this one. Why do people feel it's okay to pat our heads? Like, why are you you're laughing? Why do you... You See, he called it stroke. You stroke my head because you can see the top of my head. Why do people feel it's okay to touch somebody's head just because you're taller than them? Stop it. See, I'm being honest. I think I think this one, this is the only one that is actually, actually annoying the life out of me. I really, really hate this one. 
and I could punch you, knock you out for this. <laughs> Why do you people feel it's okay to stroke? Stroke? Why do you feel it's okay to pat my head because you're taller than me? It's not. Don't pat my head. Don't do it. This no. This is this particular one is very annoying for me. I don't like it. I honestly do not like this one. If you have short friends and if you're a short person, tell them. Tell them. Show them this part of the video. They shouldn't do it. If you have short friends and short family, if you if you have short people around you, don't be doing it. Also, <laughs> do you know my friends? I have tall friends that make fun of me. Like one joke is enough. We, we, sh we can laugh about one joke, but if, if the only jokes that you have are short jokes, like. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna fight from here one day <laughs> best believe i'm gonna knock you out so yeah the short jokes like keep them keep keep them short the short jokes keep them short next one yeah if you see a short person coming with an umbrella yeah please move please move for your own sake like if i'm coming with an umbrella and i'm short that means the umbrella is over my head like that and when the umbrella is over my head it's not going to be over your head because you're taller than me if i have to hold my umbrella like that it might be at your eye level and i i might blind you move if i don't know like some of this some some of these things are just like common sense if I'm coming with an umbrella and I'm short, move. So, like, now I have to, like, try and duck from you with my umbrella. And then the reason why I'm carrying an umbrella in the first place is because it's raining. So I have to duck from you and then I'm going to get wet because you don't have the common sense to move. If I'm coming with my umbrella, I'm going to blind you and I have the common sense to not want to blind you. So, please move, okay? When short people are coming with their umbrella, give way. Give way. <laughs> And this one is for people that I've met in this life. If we're taking pictures, we're going to stand for pictures. Look, if I don't tell you to bend or squat, please don't do it. Please, please, please. It's very rude to do so if I don't tell you not. If I don't tell you to bend or squat, you think it's nice. You think it's you being kind. or It's not nice. It's rude. Why are you bending? What are you bending for? Maybe I should post a picture of people that have bent to take pictures with me on this video so that you see why it's annoying. Like, why are you Every time I look at this picture, I'm like, what? what? <laughs> We're gonna fight? <laughs> why are you bending? It's not nice, so It's not nice. And then, don't, don't see me. As a short person coming and feel like it's okay for you to try and practice again it's like the short people's joke but this is a very very um peculiar joke like try and practice or try and mimic how i'm walking and you and you're very tall and then you bend like this and you're walking like this to show me that you're walking are you are you are you are you crazy <laughs> are you sick in the head I love because for me I've for me like I've um come to the point in life I want to say I've come to the point in life where the last time short jokes annoyed me very very much apart from having to do a video and dwelling on them is like maybe in primary school and a long time ago I've come to the realization and come to full acceptance of the fact that I am short and there's nothing anybody can do about it, not even me. There's nothing I can do about it. And Nigerians, don't ask me when I was, if I'm sure that when I was small, did I not eat enough beans? So, don't, in, Niger, in Nigeria, people have asked me, didn't I eat enough beans when I was small? It's like, are you, are you crazy? Anyway, so, what else? Can I remember anything else? I must have missed something. By the way, if you're short, please, please, 
I don't think I can do it all alone. I said when I started this video that I'm doing it for all of us, but I don't think I can do it all alone. Give tell tell us in the comment sections or tell them in the comment sections. So go and read the comments and hear from other short people what to do and what not to do. <laughs> what to do and what not to do, how to deal with us and how not to, how to behave around us and how not to behave around us. I'm pretty sure there's there are things that I can't remember. If I, can't, if I remember anything else, I'm going to put them in my comment section. I might just blog about this so that people will see it. It's like on the blog then everybody's going to be reading it. If not, I I'm, I hope that other short people will watch this and, you know, keep the conversation going in the comments. Because it's going to be an ongoing conversation. Oh! And don't ask me if I can see. If I talk about driving, don't ask me if I can see from outside the car, from inside the car, if I can see outside. Or if my legs can reach the the um, brakes and things, please. Some of these things are very annoying, and I think you pull do them on purpose. <laughs> you pull do them just to wind me up, and yeah, you succeeded. You you wound me up already. So, um, I believe that I've told you a lot of short door codes. I'm thinking. I'm trying to remember something else, but I can't remember anything else. I can't remember a lot of things. Just um, these are all short door codes, the do's and the don'ts. Do tell us nicely that we look younger. Everybody wants to look younger than they are. Short girls want to look younger than they are. So I want to look younger than I am, and I sometimes I'm happy. It's a compliment. It's a nice compliment to tell me that I look eighteen or that I look sixteen. <laughs> Maybe that's reaching, but it's a nice compliment sometimes. Other times when you assume that i'm younger it's annoying another one the way you use the word petite and thin like i know what petite means but thin i'm nothing close to thin i'm not thin at all just because i'm small does not mean i'm thin don't call me thin because you see me that i'm small i'm not thin at all i'm in no way shape or form a thin girl so like petite i can understand but thin I don't know you need to you need to make better use of your words and your description and your i don't know however you want to refer to us <sighs> all the steam is out <laughs> we can go back to living our normal short lives now that's the end of this video that's the end of the rant and the end of the video um thank you for watching don't forget to like share comment subscribe and i'll see you when I see you. Bye.